Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. Alaskan Bush People Ami Brown gets unexpected surprise. Alaskan Bush People star Ami Brown is not as prolific on social media as other members of her family. However, she took the time recently to check in with fans to let them know about some things that have been happening up at her home on the ranch in Washington. She even had Gabe along for the video. Here is what Ami had to say to her ABP fans about what is happening right now. Ami Brown reveals surprise for Alaskan Bush People fans. Ami Brown released a video for her Alaskan Bush People fans to show them some problems that are happening at her home lately. Apparently, there have been some big weather problems in Washington, and Ami took her phone and recorded her discussion about what happened. Ami Brown began her video by holding her phone and talking to the fans while Gabby stood behind her. She said the winds around her Washington home have been terrible, blowing down trees and spreading them across the roads. Ami said she was driving into town to pick up some supplies when she was stopped dead in her tracks as trees were blown across the roads, blocking her in. She said she was lucky because she had her son Gabe with her. Gabe stood behind her, shirtless and holding his brother's axe. Ami said they needed to use the axe to chop the trees into pieces to clear them from the roadway. Some fans in the comments pointed out that this would be a great opportunity to get some firewood for the upcoming Washington winter. Wonderful children that love their mom and have a helping hand. Plenty of firewood for winter this year, I'm thinking. As long as you're all safe and well that's just an inconvenience or, as I like to say, God's workout plan to keep you fit. It looks like there are several others that need to come down, I see some firewood in the making. What happened to Alaskan bush people? The last Alaskan bush people episode aired in December 2022. Since that time, there has been no word on a new season. If Discovery wanted a new season, there has been plenty of things happening that could make for good television. Rain seems to have a new boyfriend, and she has had her gold mining dreams. Bear and Raven have been together after a rough patch and have a new baby on the way. Noah has the island he bought and was planning on fixing up. However, there has been no word on a new season, and it seems like nothing is coming anytime soon, so fans will have to deal with only social media videos to keep up with the Brown family. Ami Brown, the resilient matriarch of the Brown family from the reality show Alaskan Bush People, had weathered many storms in her lifetime. Living in the rugged wilderness of Alaska, she had faced challenges that most people could only imagine. From harsh winters to the perils of the untamed wilderness, Ami had seen it all. But nothing could have prepared her for the unexpected surprise that was about to unfold. It was a crisp, clear morning in the Alaskan bush. The air was fresh with the scent of pine, and the sun cast a golden hue over the sprawling landscape. Ami stepped out of the modest cabin that she and her family called home, breathing in the tranquility of the morning. Silence was broken only by the distant call of a raven and the gentle rustling of leaves in the breeze. Ami's youngest daughter, Rain, bounded out of the cabin, her youthful energy a stark contrast to the serenity of the surroundings. Morning, Mom. She called out, her face alight with excitement. Good morning, Rain, Ami replied, smiling warmly. She always found joy in her children's enthusiasm for life in the bush. It was a tough existence, but it had its rewards. Rain came to a halt in front of her mother, a mischievous glint in her eye. There's something I want to show you, Mom, she said, her voice tinged with mystery. Ami raised an eyebrow, intrigued. What is it, Rain? Come with me, and you'll see, Rain said, grabbing her mother's hand and pulling her toward the forest. They walked through the dense undergrowth, the sounds of the forest enveloping them. Ami's curiosity grew with each step. Rain was usually straightforward, but today she seemed to be hiding something. After a short hike, they reached a clearing. Ami's breath caught in her throat as she saw what lay before her, there, in the middle of the clearing, was a small garden. It was a simple affair with rows of vegetables and a few flowering plants, but to Ami, it was a sight to behold. Rain, did you do all this? 
Ami asked, her voice filled with awe. Rain nodded, her eyes shining with pride. I wanted to surprise you, Mom. You've always worked so hard to take care of us, and I thought it was time to give something back. So, I started this garden. It's not much, but I hope it helps. Ami felt tears welling up in her eyes. She had always tried to instill a sense of self-reliance and appreciation for nature in her children, and seeing Rain take the initiative to create something beautiful and practical was more than she could have hoped for. It's beautiful, Rain, Ami said, her voice choked with emotion. I'm so proud of you. Rain beamed. I knew you'd like it. And there's more. Come on. Ami followed Rain to the edge of the clearing, where a small wooden structure stood. It was a greenhouse, carefully constructed with salvaged materials. Inside, young seedlings thrived, protected from the elements. I built this with Dad's help, Rain explained. We wanted to make sure we could grow our own food year-round, even in the harshest winters. Ami stepped inside the greenhouse, marveling at the ingenuity and hard work that had gone into its creation. She could see the promise of a sustainable future for their family, and it filled her with a deep sense of hope. This is incredible, Rain, Ami said, turning to her daughter. You've done something truly amazing. Rain's smile widened. I couldn't have done it without the things you've taught me, Mom. You've shown us how to survive and thrive in this wild place, and now it's our turn to take care of you. Ani hugged her daughter tightly, feeling a surge of pride and gratitude. It was moments like these that made all the hardships worthwhile. She knew that her family was strong and capable, and together, they could overcome anything. As they walked back to the cabin, Ami couldn't help but reflect on the journey that had brought them here. They had faced countless obstacles, but they had always persevered. The love and support they shared had been their greatest strength, and it was what would carry them forward. Later that evening, as the family gathered around the fire, Ami shared the story of Irene's surprise with the rest of the family. There were tears, laughter, and a renewed sense of unity. They were not just surviving in the Alaskan bush. They were thriving, building a future together. As the fire crackled and the stars twinkled overhead, Ami looked around at her family, feeling a profound sense of peace. She knew that no matter what challenges lay ahead, they would face them together, with love and resilience. And that was the greatest surprise of all. The realization that their strength came not just from their surroundings, but from each other.